As a student of this university, you can have your say as to who you want running your SU by voting in the up-and-coming SU elections. Voting takes place from the 31st of March to the 3rd of April 2014. But before you can vote, you have to be registered on the SU website. To register, go to www.uclansu.co.uk. Click on the Sign In tab. All elections are conducted via an online ballot. The system used within all elections here at UCLan is the Single Transferable Vote Method, or STV for short. To vote, you choose your most preferred candidate and if you want, your second, third and fourth choice. To win, candidates must get a minimum number of votes. This number is called the quota and varies in each electorate, depending on how many votes and how many candidates there are. If Ben gets more votes than he needs to be elected, his voters' second choices are now in play. In this example, most of these extra votes go to Lucy and she too gets elected. But there is still one seat to fill, so the lowest polling candidate is eliminated and those votes go to his voters' second choices, who is as yet unelected. Alice is the last candidate to get elected. Another great aspect of these elections is that if you change your mind, you can go back and change your vote as long as the ballot is still open. You can check the rules of our election on the website and if you see anything you are unhappy with, contact us at suelections at So what are you waiting for? Get voting and have your say.